Uh, we do have a 3-2-1 pills. We see both players are playing on medium and fever. Well, I know how this booth feels about that. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Looks like Don's going to try to horizontal these. Oh, perfect. He's going to get the horizontal for the reds and then the horizontal oh, for the yellows. Wonderful. What a fortuitous sequence Good for Don training. to start. And Frank just with reds everywhere on his top line and for quite a while had very little access to yellow and now he has no access to blue so this this is really difficult for frank yeah frank frank's board is is definitely not a friendly one to deal with there's there's so much red on his top line and he's just not getting much in the way of red pills to take care and, of that yeah i I think, yeah, I was going to say, I think he wants to take these reds horizontally and he's going to he's going to build up a hero combo on top of it. Hold your breath. Don't, I hope it's not it, too big. All right. Very good. Go. Uh, but Don with a six virus lead, he, he needs reds. He just needs reds at this point. Um, He has. Oh, he'll be able to take these out in a combo. Very nice. And then he just needs three more red halves. And he will be out at a 137. And then Frank out at a 139. Seemed like both players had the same problem on that level. It's like, you, you know it's bad when you're near the end of your level and you have one virus left of a certain color. And then you have all of these garbage fragments of every other color on your board that you weren't able to do anything with. And that's how you know that RNG is messing with you. Yeah. Don with a very nice fat log drop combo. Um, Frank's board is pretty split. Um, I like what he's setting up here with this T to get rid of that garbage. Very he's nicely done. He has a ton of double clear opportunities that he's going to be able to get through this board very quickly. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I'm a little concerned with Dawn about that one red floating over in column one. Nice play there um, by Dawn, finding the triple horizontal. And I like that drop from him as well. There we go. There goes that um, that red in column one. That's the best way to do it. Um, is when you get a, a double pill and you can just take everything with no drop time. That's the best way to take care of those. But it is five to three, except Frank has two of them combined. Frank's to be out at a three eleven. Mm hmm. And looking at this early board for Frank here, there's a lot of yellow and blue and not much in the way of red, but very efficient. Quick horizontal clears, and he's exposed some red viruses and gotten some color diversity in his board. Mm -hmm. Don was out at a 324 into level 10. I, I like this board better than I think a, a lot of the other boards I've seen so far. It really does seem to be pretty diverse. Now uh, Don doesn't have any access to red, but... Um, he should be able to open some of that up soon. Yeah, looking at Dawn's board right now, as the virus count is pretty much dead even, signaling he, signaling he wants to take out those blues horizontally. And right now it's just a matter of getting a blue-red. Because that's probably why he put the double red there, so that he needs he so that he can use more than just a double blue to get that play done. Mm -hmm. And here we oh, are. And here it comes. He's just got a little bit of red garbage. He's already cleaned that up. Um, but Frank has a ten virus lead at this point. But Frank just had Frank just got reds. He's got that red. one yellow, which is now gone, and then just reds. Nice tuck play there by Frank. 
Just needs to keep getting some reds and he'll be out of here. Creates the zero drop situations. Very good. And um, Don, over on his board, you can tell he's he is looking for specifically a blue red um, to under clear in column one um, <coughs> and two, and then bring all there of that is. down. It is going to create some drop time with those reds, but the next two get him out at a five twenty five. Looking at Frank's board, a lot of double clear opportunities are waiting for him. He's he's got he's got possibly a fat log set up. Oh, here. he here wants he's comes. getting it. He's getting it. There we go. Very nice. We love our fat logs here in the Dr. Mario community. And I I can guarantee he wants to take all those reds in the center of his board. He wants to take them all together. Yeah, he's well on his way to doing that. All he needs is, let's see if he tucks this blue-red. Yep. Mm -hmm. And he's going to build up more. Now all he needs is one red fragment, and the red-blue is perfect to get this perfect. huge Ooh. drop combo. Very nice. Very nice. Maybe a future fat log set up here. Okay, it looks like he's taking the red-blues and throwing them over to the left to attack column one. So it is 4 to 11 in this level 11. Very nice tuck from Frank. Um, Dawn not needing any yellow and, and getting a decent amount of it, unfortunately. Um, setting looks, things up, but it is not going to be enough. Frank is going to take that with a 650. Dawn is one red fragment away from finishing this one off, and there it is, 702. Very respectable. Yeah, very, time. very, yeah, very close. 10, 12 seconds in Dr. Mario, especially in, in your later levels, is almost nothing. <laughs> so, very, very well done from both players. We're going to get reset and on to our second crown. So, of course, that cat is not Frank, but he loves his Looney Tunes, so. Frank loves cats as well. Yep. So, Sylvester's a natural fit. Exactly. And we have our countdown. Three, two, one, pills! Game two. Frank is at match point. Don's fighting for his tournament life. like this opening opener by frank mm, yeah i know he wishes he could have taken the um the blue and color oh, one as well oh nice fat log um but frank is um frank is very very adaptable with his play style um mm -hmm. if he's not getting what he needs he will adjust until uh whatever he needs works for him now he's got a nice play. He an, an ideal play. Okay, it looks like he played the the horizontal from the other side. He had several plays he could have done with that. He could have gotten gotten it from the right. If he got a a double blue, it would have been perfect. But he didn't need the double blue, which was key there. Mm -hmm. um, but it is very close. It is twelve to fourteen. Um, Don with very nice swim. Again, Flindo is going to be very happy with that. Absolutely, this is uh, this is a tight game so far. The, their um, frank... And it's it's a lot of needing um, blues and yellows on both sides. And this is exactly what Frank needs to get out of this level right now, and he's going to be out at a one twenty six. Wow, that is a really good time for level eight. Yeah, and that's just something that Frank does. His end games are very clean and they just like appear yeah um you know don is a great player frank was just like oh end game and done 
Yeah. Um, the, the thing about Frank is the way he plays his end games is when he gets pills that he doesn't really need in the immediate, he'll start throwing things to the bottom of the board to find optimal ways to clear that later while he's waiting for the pills he needs. Nice fat mm-hmm. lot there by Frank. Yeah, he, he does do that. Um, and that's a very... Um, it's a very heads-up way of playing Dr. Mario. Um, Don getting those horizontals off of his board. There's, there's some that, that would tempt me. As, as someone who gets very tempted by, ooh, shiny, sparkly combo. Absolutely. I mean, if you, if you see it, you want it. I know. I, I, I take that approach in, in most areas of my life, as you know. Everybody's, everybody likes a little swag in their play. So, Frank just down to three. Oh, nice tuck. All he needs are some reds. What you, what you see there is just movement precision. Because when you, when you can drop it down with the down button and time it just right to tuck it in, without having to wait for nat- the natural gravity of medium speed. Mm-hmm. It works out great. Yeah. Dawn, right, uh, um, right after him at a 322. I like the horizontal opportunities he potentially has. I know he's, he's trying to set some up. I see them. I see what you're doing. Nice drop combo by Don there. Has a little bit of garbage in columns four and five, but that's immediately cleared up. <clears throat> Frank dealing with a lot of uh, blue and yellow. He needs a lot of all of it. Um, whereas Don's board is a lot more diverse. Um has a use for basically everything. Um, there's a, I would say a little bit more red than I'm comfortable with on the board, but he is getting some reds right now um, that make it a little bit more even. And it looks like he's going to use that double red to attack column one. And why not? Because he doesn't want that oh, to be a Frank. Frank is one yellow like, away. Frank had a fat lock set up like three and four off of the bottom. And for a second, I thought he was really going to try to make it work. Hmm. All right, so looking at Dawn, this is, this is actually a nice setup for Dawn because that drops down and then the reds are perfectly lined up. Looks like he's going to do the underclear okay. into the drop combo. He's going to want, oh, I wish you put that in the uh, column seven, but that's okay. Um, he's out at a 506-ish um, into right. level 11. <laughs> uh, he, is, he is down by almost 20 viruses at this point, though. It's going to be really tough sledding to make this comeback, and and Frank has a really friendly board, too, and that's not going to make it any easier. Mm-hmm. Frank, maybe a little bit of a misplay. I'm... Probably intended to horizontal that blue in column three. He I can think still so. do it if he... Oh, that's actually... If he, if he laid that double blue horizontally, he would have had mm-hmm. the combo, but it looks like he wanted to avoid the drop time. Yeah. He takes it now. Needs a lot of red help. Um, and he just has the um, the one yellow and the one blue down at the bottom. Now it's just the one red, or I'm sorry, the one yellow. I know, I know my colors. <laughs> um, and he is going to be out with just one more. At a 6.30. Wow, that is a blazing time for Frank. 